Hello, so we're going to watch a video on a Bloomberg interview between Ethereum co-founder uh, Vitalik Buterin, and we're going to analyze his pronunciation and his mannerism, his vocal mannerisms. I'm going to break it down and see if you can sound like him too and uh, computer programming and uh, cryptography and technology. I um, was also... Bitcoin is uh, really interesting because of how interdisciplinary it is. I was... Uh... Bitcoin is very interesting because of how in interdisciplinary it is. So when he said interdisciplinary, uh, it kind of sounded interdis... He elongated the E sound too much. Because as you can see here in the dictionary, interdisciplinary, inner, interdisciplinary, interdisciplinary. So we don't inner interdisciplinary is it has a short e sound, but what he said is actually uh, he said it like this. He's inter. So he kind of I'm going to add this symbol here, which means we extend the previous symbol sound so we say in he said inter interdisciplinary uh, very interested in math and uh, computer programming and uh, cryptography and technology i uh, cryptography and technology uh, cryptography and technology yeah technology technology the technology was a weird everything else was flawless but the way he said technology Chinese people always have a problem. I heard the Alibaba founder say uh, technology doesn't even bother to pronounce the Y. So it should be pronounced technology. Technology. But he's a, he's a technology. And technology. 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 So he kind of added a diphthong sound to the technology. So he said something like, he said something like technology. G. So he added a schwa sound. So he said technology when it's not, it's just without the schwa sound. Yeah, I was also very interested in like economics and kind uh, of politics and philosophy. And uh, Bitcoin. He done it, he done it again. He, he's done it again with philosophy. So he adds this weird sound, this weird diphthong sound, double vowel sound. When you said philosophy, you should say philosophy, philosophy, but he ended up saying philosophy, philosophy. Okay, so that makes it sound that will, that will make make native speakers notice, huh? Philosophy, technology, Whatever blockchain application you want to build. Whatever Bitcoin application you want. So that's a grammatical error. So he said, uh, if you say you want, then the verb wants, then obviously the verb wants does not agree with the subject you. So we need to conjugate want, you want. But apart from that, I think his American accent is very good, uh, especially especially his er pronunciation of the er sound of the rolling tongue at the back cryptocurrency um, founder of the cryptocurrency so i think he does it in the perfect technique er You can just write the logic of that application in the programming language, um, upload that program to the chain, and this uh, becomes what we call a smart contract. And 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 anyone can then. But when he says with your and and is a bit strange. Like that sounds a little bit Russian when he says and because he says and instead of saying and. Remember, you want to be opening your mouth. And your tongue must be going out as if if you saw a wolf, if you want to shout and scream, you was, if you want to scream, you would go. Ah. But he says, if you were to scream when you saw a wolf, he would, his tongue would be like this first, so he can generate the e sound. So he will be screaming like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
but there is no e sound. Again, there's a diphthong problem, so you want to say ant. 